Uh, what is very interesting to see is that we are growing both when it comes to the ingredient products like uh, for Nestle, cultures for Nestle and other uh, uh, companies taking ingredients from us and our finished uh, products. So we see uh, very good growth in both segments and that's of course very satisfying. This is a very difficult question because we are really in a launching phase and uh, we don't know how much is, is uh, ongoing sales and how much is launched. So I'm afraid I can't answer that question. Uh, uh, I would like to know myself, but uh, this is uh, really difficult uh, uh, to tell. We have taken a number of actions. Uh, firstly, we did a new agreement with Fleet, and um, they're going to launch in the beginning of next year. Then we have also already since before, we have uh, a distributor distributing our own brand by the Gaia brand in the US. That both are uh, oil drops for uh, babies and also tablets. And we are supporting them with a lot of new marketing material, also some marketing uh, contribution. And their marketing program uh, has just started, uh, beginning of October. Uh, it's a lot of on internet, uh, it's a lot of in-store promotion in the uh, Walgreens shops. And, and we are now looking to see the results of that. Uh, and, but we are prepared to do more if needed, because uh, we, we're going to succeed in the US as well. But it will take a little bit of time. I mean, that's a, a great area to get into the pediatrician. You know, if you have a, a cure for uh, colic, uh, the pediatrician will recommend the product to the parents and the parents will then buy the product in the pharmacy. Uh, but that's only sort of a, a way of getting into the market. What happens is that uh, when parents and doctors and health professionals see what happens, that the, the baby is doing well, uh, the stomach is working well, the parents will continue to use it. So in many markets we see that uh, babies are using this not only for the first three or six months but up to one year. So it's a much larger market than only colic. So we're not re we're dependent on that as an introduction to the market but not for the, for the f growth of the market. You know that we're building a new factory in, in the south of Sweden and uh, it's a rather big investment and the, the factory will be ready in the first uh, half of next year. And uh, the reason for this, uh, for this new building is that um, uh, the quality requirements are much higher now from our customers and also volumes are, are increasing so we need more capacity. But there is another thing also with this investment is that, you know, we doing and Tupac is, is creating here a top-notch uh, facility and uh, the best you can get uh, you can find on the market and together with Tupac we are able to develop new products with better stability and in this at the same time integrating uh, the, 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 the construction of the machines at the same time as we are inventing the products so that gives us a very good productivity in terms of you know eco economies of scale and uh, efficacy, stability, um, so so that's really why we're doing this investment, and we're trying to to uh, support them as much as we can. You know, this year we have had a lot of focus on on the U.S. and uh, Japan. And of course that will continue. So I, I think we will follow that very closely. Uh, we're not quite there yet. The Japanese operation is not profitable yet, but uh, we want it to be that pretty quickly. Sales are going well out there, so I, I, I see no reason why we couldn't be profitable next year. Uh, the uh, other area which we want to really focus on is uh, uh, the oral health area. We have fantastic studies coming out, we have good results in some mar markets and we have sort of restructured that business and now it's time to roll it out in other markets. So that will be a lot of focus on that uh, during the coming six months or um, well, to, to a year. And then 
an area which is basically day-to-day uh, -day work, you know, we have contracts today for almost 40, 40 markets where we have not launched yet. And so there is a lot of regulatory work. So we are stepping up our efforts there to speed up the regulatory process in, in various countries. And because, you know, the earlier we can launch in a country, the, the, the earlier we get some income and, and, you know, every day is worth a lot of money. We have two uh, H. pylori studies coming out here uh, this year. Um, we will give some sort of news uh, before the end of the year. Uh, we'll come with a release uh, telling uh, the market about uh, the results of the study. Of course, the, the, the full reports will not be available this year, uh, but we will tell uh, the market uh, what the general results are for this year. We don't know ourselves yet, but uh, you know, we will definitely tell this uh, this year. We have very good hope that they will keep this uh, timetable. You know.